Well, the, uh, the experts at Colorado State University are predicting a less active hurricane season this year. Forecasters predict 10 named storms and only two of them will be considered major. There is a 42% chance that at least one big hurricane will make landfall here in the U.S. And Gil, I know this right up your alley. Oh, yeah. Are these folks normally pretty accurate at uh, Colorado State? I'll tell you, I look back at the last couple of years. Last year, they kind of over-predicted a little bit about how much activity, mm -hmm. but not by much. They're usually within, let's say, one to three storms, typically right. year after year. They're the early ones. They pull the trigger first right. on what they think. They're basing a lot of it this time around on what the ocean temperatures are in the Atlantic. They're saying it's a little bit cooler. Mm -hmm. Also, what you hear about sometimes El Nino. Right. They're expecting that to influence. And what happens with that, Keith, El Nino sends a little more wind across the basin, making it harder for those storms to grow. One thing I always say, though, right. we both know we had one storm here right. last year, and people are still picking up the pieces. Right. And we people, have a lot of people living in coastal neighborhoods. Yeah, yeah, we do. And I'll tell you, that's why I always ask people, even though you hear the downplay of numbers, right. Keith, it please only takes prepare. One. And the official season kicks off June 1st. By the way, WXEdge.com okay. just threw a whole article together about this research. You can click it and go page by page yourself. Pretty in-depth stuff. Right. But again, even though we talk lower, prepare anyway. A lot of stuff people be interested in. Absolutely.